Ilo, Ilo. He, she told our friend who, who, who came to tell us the message from my mom. Is two things my mom told me to do. Love your, 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 your sister, because I'm not loving to my sister. We're always fighting. We're always uh, quarreling. He said, love your sister and be a pastor. And my father, a non Seventh day Adventist Christian, impelled me or coerced me to finish the Bachelor of, of Science in Marine Transportation. That's the nautical course to be a seaman in preparation to be a, a sea captain later on in, in life. I told my dad, I will just finish this because you want me to finish this, but I would like to serve God and I would like to finish theology because my mom told me so to be a pastor. Obedience to parents is very important. When I finish my bachelor, uh, when associate in marine transportation because I need to finish my experience in the, in the, in the sea, my dad told me to, to, to go and work. <coughs> I disobeyed. My father asked me to leave the house pack up my things and he gave me I remember 1,000 pesos that's about, uh, about $50 five. get out 25. I don't want to see your 20, face anymore 25. you are $25 <laughs> you are a stubborn disobedient ungrateful guy get out of my house and obedient as I am I, I, I brought my, my, my bags <laughs> at walk. Do you know where I stayed after my dad? You know, my dad fired me from my house. I stayed in the church. For almost one year, I stayed in the church. The janitor was feeding me with noodles and sardines. Oh, my favorite. <laughs> I have no choice. I have no money. I have no shelter. I have no family. But I remember one time when I when when my father knew that I was there, he would bring he would bring I cannot forget because we were not in good terms. He would secretly give to my janitor friend this rice, a, a bag of rice here. This is for my son who left the house. But actually, he told me to to leave the house. <laughs> Very pain, painful. I proceed with my theology and after two years just before my father died I heard from from Bacala he was in Ilo Ilo my father died of cancer I was not able to see him but they told me but they told me that my dad was baptized as a Seventh-day Adventist Christian because I stood in the faith as a Seventh-day Adventist Christian and that's the reason why God has blessed me right now. For six years, I'm in the ministry working for the Lord. My father was baptized. My mother was faithful to the Seventh Avenue Church. Friends, although my father may have some lapses, but I tell him, I told the people there, he's the best dad he could ever be. It was not his fault. His parents treated him like that as well. It was not his fault. Treat each other lovingly, you will live longer. Trust each other faithfully, you will be happier together. Treat each other better than yourselves, you will stay together. May God bless you.